I knew that they went after her for singing Strange Fruit. I don't think I knew the extent to which they went after her. I don't know that it was really unto her deathbed. And I think a lot of people just assume that she died because she was an addict and because, and she did, there were health effects. There were things about her body that were coming apart, but they wanted her to to die. They wanted her, the message was so strong. She was integrating audience. She was singing about lynching in America. So I didn't know the extent to which they went after her. I did know they were trying to silence her for singing Strange Fruit. Um, and I think that's a part of what made me such a huge fan is that, you know, she's a, a person who deals with life and deals with trauma and is fractured, but she was not willing to put the song down because the message was too important to her. And she really was a fighter and she, the message was too important. She was talking about lynching America. She was integrating audiences and she wasn't willing to put the song down to the detriment of her own safety. And um, that's what I want people to know when they see the movie that we owe her a debt of gratitude. There was definitely a need and I did feel a duty to honor her and to honor her legacy, not just as a person, you know, but because I'm also a musician, it mattered to me to honor her legacy musically as well too, with her voice and the way she sang and the way she phrased things. So yeah, I mean, it's big shoes, you know, to fill, but I wasn't necessarily trying to fill them. I was more so just trying to say thank you to her through the performance for everything that she has imparted to me as a singer, because she is my foremost inspiration. So it's a full circle moment for sure. Dealing with the pandemic, honestly, I've been praying a lot. You know, I'm definitely I'm a very spiritual person and my, my relationship with God means a lot to me. So I've been just trying to get closer and be more spiritually grounded and then spending more time with family, you know, trying to be grateful. I think that's a big thing is just remembering it's a very difficult time, but I do have a lot to be grateful for. And I, the one upside, if I'm trying to look glass half full is that I, I'm more grounded. I get to spend more time with family and, and it helps me focus even more on, you know, the movie and, promotion and everything we're doing with, you know, the narrative and trying to honor her character. So gratitude, I think, is a big thing.